it's on there in the uh, the party settings. Sometimes it's weird. Sure. Also on tonight's show, Big Jobo Hairyfoot comes back from the dead to talk about his remarkably short tenure as captain of the Greenfield Grass Huggers. It's 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 kind of early. <laughs> I haven't been I haven't been up this early on a Friday in a long time. Oh yeah. Awesome. Hey, it's good to get them out of the get to go ahead and get a blood bowl out of the way so you got the rest of the day off though, so I understand. Um, I think you share like your your voice. It says like allow my voice to be shared. I'm actually going to check here, too. Um, yeah, it's under party settings. And then in the party settings, there's a little tab that says allow your voice to be shared. And you can do allow for current party or always allow. All right. Got it. All right. Awesome. I am spinning now. I actually like that you let us play old teams Team instead of having to start mm, new ones. This is going to be Yeah, it's it go it kind of goes back to the Fumble days. I don't know if you ever played on Fumble. Yeah, I've played quite a bit of Fumble. But what that's one thing I like about it is you could take you can build up a team and if the league went south people stopped playing it or whatever, you weren't stuck with this cool team that you liked, that you invested money in. Oh yeah, and I agree. You know, we used to play tabletop in college, we would do that all the time. We had I'm so two or three oh, yeah. groups that would play, and I mean, sure, some of it, you had to be on your Let's honor about it, you wouldn't lie or be full of shit. Yeah. Um, and it's a little easier to track whether someone's full of shit here. Oh yeah. you can see who they played. <laughs> we, it's, last season yeah. we had a guy who came in with the 1400 chaos team mm -hmm. i'm like all right cool and you know i i didn't do my due diligence as the commissioner but i also didn't expect i'd have to actually do this mm -hmm. um i ended up having to make an announcement on our community that said all right if you haven't played any of your games against actual life people that doesn't count <laughs> because this, this guy he, he was like I, I, he, we're GFCL originally stood for Game Facts Championship. Yeah. Because I built this off of the Game Facts page. Right. And one guy was like, hey, what team value are you looking for? And I told him the range. <laughs> and he said, okay, cool. And then he sent his team in. And apparently he had just set up another PSN account. Yes. And made a league and played against himself enough times to get to 1400. So he was like 16 and 0. No one was injured. Everyone was getting two MVPs a game, <laughs> and he didn't see a problem with it. And I was like, dude, he, and, and I, so I called him on it, and he was like, yeah, well, you didn't say I couldn't do that. Yeah. I'm like, well, I have to say that you... Uh, I feel and, like <laughs> it, it might would have been okay if he wasn't doing the concedes. That's like his right. issue, because well, he was yeah, conceding yeah, to himself. That would have been slightly better if he was playing against the, the AI. But he wasn't even doing What's that. The best and then the I was like, "Well, I'm sorry, I got to kick the uh, team out." Run faster, you know. And he and he, then he starts, you know, getting all irate and salty and like, "Well, fuck you, you know, you're you guys talking like you're fags, like all that good internet." Yeah. Oh yeah. You know, showing showing what, what repartee he had. Yeah. And I'm like, "Well, hey man, I'm sorry you're upset, but 
If you decide to come back, door's always open. And the last thing he said was, fuck your door. <laughs> and all I could think of was that, that, that um, that, the Dave Chappelle sketch with, 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 J- the, with, uh, with Rick James on the dude's couch. With, with, fuck your couch. <laughs> fuck your couch, darkness. That's all I could think of. <laughs> And I, I, I brought that out to the group, and everyone just had a really good laugh at it. So if nothing else, yeah. I mean, sorry for your for your damn luck, but thanks for the good laugh, because that was hilarious. Oh, yeah. That's, Fuck uh, your door. <laughs> that's pretty golden right there. Yeah. Um, Every now and then it'll come up, someone will say, Hey, Johnny, I'm going to come over and have sex with more of your furniture. You need my <laughs> door out of this, though. Yep, no people. But yeah, it's cool that you can go and see who people have played and what league they've played in. And oh, yeah. There's, there's a, a history there, so if any shenanigans went on, you can see it. I'm also kind of against concedes in general. Like, if someone doesn't make it to a match, I'm more prone to give the, the person who did make it or the person who tried to set it up the most a 2-1 victory. Yeah. Yeah, you two two concede. ones are the way to go. Yeah. I mean, the true concedes I think should be really rare because getting double MVPs and double double gold is just it, it just breaks it, the league in some ways. Yeah, it's not good for everybody in that situation. Yeah. You just can't do the concede. You have to do the two one. Yeah. Which, in a perfect world, we'd have teams that. You know, never, um, never conceded. There'd be no concedes. Every game would get played. But yep. unfortunately, this isn't a perfect world. So on balance, I prefer the passing game. To running down the perfect the world we would have more teams already. I agree. <laughs> I'm ready for Norse to come out just because I want to play the new teams. I like running down the field. I'm more excited for the prospect of Undead. I really hope they give us something like Goblins. Oh yeah. I, I really would like a fun team. Yeah, Goblins would be fun. The only thing that's going to suck though is all the special yeah, weapons that like they have to do. <laughs> Gathering around that lone player, like halfway oh, around the map. Well done. I have the ball now. Step one, all right. up close and personal, Bob. You need to be close. So close they can smell your breath and see the dead insects in your teeth. Hmm. I love that your one dude has these, like, green glowing horns. They're ridiculous. <laughs> 
I'm sitting here staring at them because I've never saw that before. Oh yeah. Yeah, they, they've actually got some pretty good flavor here and there. Like, I'm always appreciative of it. Now that's a holding maneuver, if ever I saw one. Reminds me of the no. famous story of Nurgling and the Great Unclean. But this time, no miracles. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I love the sound of the Skaven when they're in pain. Sounds like this next game. Probably he'll probably be fired by next game and replaced. Okay? <laughs> yeah. I think he already had a niggle, I think, so Yeah, he did. That's why I took the both down. <laughs> well, I got a good opportunity here. You've been playing a while then? Uh, I've been playing since November. Um, on this one. Now, I've been playing, okay. uh, a fumble in that time too. Yeah. So. Right. Oh. Oh. Uh, Philip J. Boy. Fry on Good Friday. Ow. Is that what today is? Yeah. Right. See, that's why I thought you were you might have been wanting to play this early because you got today off for Good Friday. Because I I've, I've had people. Yeah, no. I've had people telling me that they are off for that, so. I don't know. I, yeah, I, I barely remember that Sunday is Easter. The only reason <laughs> I know that is because there's going to be ham somewhere. Mm, ham. Why do I have six rerolls? How did that happen? Is that like half of my team value? <laughs> Oh, wow. Yeah, I would probably say so. Would be a good way to shave a little off. That's a good economical pass. That's a pass no amateur can catch. Only a pro can manage a play like that. I love a good team team like this. Like your team? Yeah, and your your Green Bay pack rats are fun too. Ow! That speed. It will be difficult to catch. The tail, Jim. All you need is the tail.
Yeah. Quick little buggers. Yeah. Nuffles with me today so far. It used to be that you could give anyone with a strength two the trait of stunty. Yeah. If you roll doubles and stuff. Yeah. Uh, I noticed kind of that they that it's taken out because um, I uh, I kind of kept up with the rules of Blood Bowl, but I never played. If that makes sense. Um, All right. Because uh, I used to play 40k and I played Magic: The Gathering a lot. And that I like the aspect of Blood Bowl, but none of the local hobby shops and card shops played it. Because it's such a niche game that, like, certain yeah. crowds don't play, you know? No deal. Because Blood Bowl's not for everybody, and I accept that fact. I accept yeah. the fact that there are people who are never going to ever find enjoyment in this game. Just because... It takes it takes a special kind of person to like this whole community and role playing aspect and everything, you know. Yeah, and then you have it's a niche within a niche too, because you gotta have, because a lot of blood bowl doesn't make sense. <laughs> oh yeah, the the fluff just doesn't make sense at all a lot at times, yeah. and it doesn't matter. And that's part of its charm in my in my view. I agree. Yeah. I fully agree. That's just gonna prevent me from stalling. <laughs> That's the point, yeah. Yeah, I figured as much. Which I usually try not to stall because I found that, well, one, the more you stall, the more SPP that you're wasting, but two, the more likely there is for something to go wrong. Yeah, there's definitely, you know, drastic failures yeah. that can happen. Absolutely I, I once uh, beat. A uh, dwarf team who had me down to three elves because he decided <laughs> to stall. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I had and a game. He botched, he botched the roll, and I got to him, and he got the ball, and mm -hmm. that was that. Yeah, I had an MML game this season that I played orcs. They scored on me first because they stole the ball from me, and then they got. I had to kick to them in the second half. Well, it takes them yeah. eight turns to score, and he tries to pass to, like, level up his QB for the <laughs> for the touchdown, too, because the, it, both people would have got SPP there, and they both would have leveled up in that situation. So he right. does the pass. The guy's in the end zone. He fumbles the catch. So he re-rolls, and he fumbles the catch again. And so he drops the ball out of the back of the end zone, and the crowd throw it in about midfield. I have a gutter runner pick the ball up, run down, and pat at the end of his movement range, and pass to a to a storm vermin who was in scoring range. And he he caught it and made it with one GFI and didn't even need his reroll that I had. No, perfect. Yeah. Yep. It was great. I've seen really crazy things happen. Alright, so hopefully I've set myself pretty well for next turn, if nothing else. Play mouse dudes coming in. If, if you couldn't tell, those two gutter runners hog all of the SPP. The two <laughs> move 10 ones. <laughs> yeah, that's usually what happens. I think that's how a rat team is supposed to be built, though. Your gutter runners and your storm vermin are your beefy pieces, and then the linemen are just cannon fodder. Oh, totally. And totally. Just the, the quarterback 
is a makeshift blitzer a lot of times. Because for some reason, he gets the most injuries on my team, usually, my quarterback. I've never understood how that works. But, well, I should say thrower. I have the habit of calling the pieces what they would be in American football. Yeah. Like, I, I'll call the, the gutter runners running backs or receivers or... <laughs> Makes sense. Okay, so you got... <clears throat> so are you a Futurama fan? Yeah, I, I really dig the, the whole aspect of Futurama. I've watched it, like, since it, like, came on TV, because I used to watch uh, the channel every Sunday anyway. Yep. And it would come on, and I just kept watching and watching. Uh, I really dig it. And then I always watched it on Adult Swim, too, when it had that long yeah. run on there. Yep, thanks to them, it got a, a reboot. Maybe yeah. Maybe. Uh, this is a very precarious defensive situation with two dino injuries. The thing about mm -hmm. is how it brings everyone together in a common joy of death. You have orcs, dwarfs, men, even beast men sharing the delightful violence in the same stadium and all desperate to see some shredding death. So you said you played tabletop, so I assume you've played quite some time. Yeah, um, I got my first Blood Bowl set. Um, I actually got it backwards. I was like 10 or 12 in a hobby shop and saw the box for Dungeon Bowl. Yeah. And spent my paper root money on it because it was so cool looking. And then realized, oh wait, this is half a game. Because <laughs> Dungeon Bowl was just an expansion, it didn't have any of the real rules in it, it just had the addendum rules. Yeah. Um, so, that was, so that was a little learning experience in and of itself. But I um, then got Blood Bowl and a few friends together, and we kind of pieced together the, the, a couple seasons. And I was hooked. Um, not, every, not all my buddies were at that point, but yeah. I certainly was. And then when I got to college, um, I mean, I, I had the I had the set in my house forever, and I would play my own leagues, you know. Yeah. Because um, I didn't have anyone else to do it with, and that that got fun. But I eventually I got bored of it, packed it all oh, away, yeah. got to college later, and found a whole gang of people who were playing it out there. So that that kind of rekindled my interest in it. That's awesome. And um, yeah, and then found fumble a little while after college and things like that. Just kind of stuck with it over the years. Yeah, I can't say Blood Bowl's been good to me because Blood Bowl isn't good to anybody. But <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. you know, Nuffle is always smiling. You just never know who he's smiling. Who at. he's smiling at? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Or an F, it, it would be smiling at anybody. Deformity of the body would yeah. be so effective on a Blood Bowl pitch. I'm still curious as to why I have five rerolls. I'm gonna have to uh, to do something about that. <laughs> yeah, that's worth looking into for sure. <laughs> I didn't know. I know that this is like the very first team that I ever built, and I played in the open ladder all the time. So I feel like I've just done some dumb stuff along the way with this team. <laughs> yeah. I've heard stroking him on his belly or chin may calm him down. Yeah, 
Yeah, these guys played in season one, and I ended up with a couple of dead Chaos Warriors. So right. some of this uh, is a rebuild. Uh, makes sense. Against a full speed horned boot. Look at the nurse. That's an official slogan of Blood Bowl, too. <laughs> uh, it it, it could have been worse. <laughs> that should have been that should be on a teaser. Blood Bowl. It could have been worse. is strength. Ah. I gotta deal with him. That guy's a target. <laughs> I figured he would turn into one. <laughs> viewer. I don't know who it is, but we got one. You got what? I said we had oh, another viewer? a viewer come up. I don't know yeah. who it is, but it's one. So, <laughs> hello there, viewer. Friends. <laughs> Tell all your friends. Yeah. Tell all your friends. This is going to be decisive. Not Morbo. <laughs> the, the the storm vermin say what's up. <laughs> Apparently, they uh they came in with force there. Yeah, they did. Is the assist gonna be enough to come out on top? Oh man! Not the headless body of Agnes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, your team is killing me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope they do, but I understand what you're saying. They, uh, they, they already did. Like when I looked them up, I saw them, and I, I already cracked up, and I was just like, I'm gonna laugh this whole game just because of yep. every one of its guys' names. Yep, that's one of my favorite things about the game is coming up with themes. I have a lizard man team named Eddie's Lizards. Yeah. They're all named after Eddie Izzard jokes. That's awesome. Yeah. Twinkle toes there. Uh. All right, well, once again, that could have been worse. Most definitely. I did not want to put a little line rat on that minotaur, but I had no choice because I don't want to get blitzed <laughs> by it. Cannot afford to get blitzed oh, by that thing. <laughs> no, not not usually. Frenzy is still alive though. Back and then, 
think they're two strength. Yeah, unfortunately. Don't line that up better. Old traditional spectacle in this style. I know this one. Torobania. Oh man. Opened up a whole alleyway. Kinda. I'm gonna get swarmed here though. If only the headless body of Agnew would survive. <laughs> yeah, it probably would have helped. Yeah. Them's the brakes. He is surrounded. <laughs> I love that the goat men actually baa when you click them. Yeah. <laughs> That's good stuff. Ah, at least they have teammates around. I haven't played against a whole lot of chaos, or played a lot of chaos, so there's some of the yeah. idiosyncrasies that I just haven't picked up. Yeah. They're pretty fun. The, uh, the mutations make them a very malleable team. Mm -hmm. Whereas, days gone by, they were just 90% murder machines. Mm -hmm. um, but lately, they've become a little more... Uh, come on, guys. You can move Change around a little, a little easier, make them do what you want them to do. Yeah. Yeah, I would imagine where... Uh... Ooh. Where uh, the mutations would really help out in a lot of situations. Yeah. Um, which they kind of do with Skaven too, so I can imagine on Chaos. Yeah. 
Especially with them already having horns. Starting off with horns. Yeah, that, that's a nice feature. Because you can you effectively have another strength war guy. Yeah, all the time. Then we may see a touchdown. No. Oh, the skull was definitely the best choice there. <laughs> it I, you means, know, I, I missed it. <laughs> it it means death to your opponent. That's what the skull stands for. It's like a death no. symbol. Like the Punisher, how his logo is a skull. <laughs> yeah, I gotta start watching the Daredevil. Maybe that's what I'll do. It's on my day off today. I've heard that it's good. I haven't checked the second one out, the second season out. Oh, the yet. first season is so good. I, I enjoyed it. Yeah, I enjoyed yeah. it. I'm a big fan of Daredevil the comic, so the yeah, having. Having that show sort of wash the taste of that terrible Ben Affleck movie out of my mouth was really good. Yeah. I wanted that movie to be so good and it just failed every way possible. Except for the guy that played Daredevil's dad. That guy was spot on. Everything yeah. else, shit. And man, Ben Affleck can't win a superhero movie to save his life. I'm hearing nothing but terrible reviews about Batman vs. Superman. I've heard that too, um, just from like the critics and stuff though, when it first was yeah. announced. Yeah. I don't know anyone who's seen it yet, so I'm very still out in that respect. But. Yeah. This is one of those situations, it's like, I got four re-rolls, why not? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. For some reason. Test yeah. knuffle. <laughs> hey, sometimes he's not a completely cruel bastard. <laughs> sometimes. <Just> somewhat cruel. <laughs> and then other times he is the cruelest bastard. Yeah. I'm laying and praying with that storm burning over there. <laughs> mm -hmm. about to get punched above and below the belt at the same time. Fans are rubbing, so am I. Just one more step. Hey, that works for me. <laughs> Come on, Marbo. Oh, Morbo oh. kills the man. 
<laughs> Your dad was probably gonna get fired anyway. He's dead, Jim. But not as we know. It's Sorry. not even the second half. Uh. <laughs> Alright, clamps. Didn't you proud? All I need to do is get there. Oh. Should hire a team player. Alright. Let's see how that turns out. <clears throat> yeah, we've also got a ladder going. Uh, if you've got a team you want to try out to get people right. to do it. Okay. Uh, uh, Smack Bar, one of our guys from, he's been with us in season one. He played dwarves for two seasons, but quietly built up this wood elf team he's using now in the ladder. Yeah. So he went from dwarves to wood elf, and we're like, how do. Ah. Uh, this doesn't even make sense. But okay. Alright, so what? So close. Impressive. <clears throat> Long clear. This is the purest Amazing. Movement. Well Bloody done. Game. No oh no, he's got to catch it. Come on, catch it, bud. No, you won't. got it. Oh, no, yes. Yeah. Totally nice. totally oh, got man. That. Good game. And that's the game, folks. No, that's not it. We got another half. Uh, no, it's it's 2-0. There's no way I'm scoring three points in one, in one half. Very best, I this is a tie. But you've won this game. Is it too late you think so, man? Absolutely. I can, I'll probably score once. But, um... It'll be a 2-1 win for you. Now, how many players you'll have for next game is the question? Yeah, that's what I'm, I'm worried about, actually. <laughs> but yeah, you, you definitely won. Good, well played. I imagine that in their dreams... I can't believe that he made the pass, yet the catch did, needed to be rerolled. That's what, that's what I was confused hill. about. <laughs> Despite being in the lead, I mean, you always have a one in six chance of failing. Score. That's true. And that's not a that's not a small amount. <laughs> right. Oh man, I only have positionals. Nah, it's not that bad. I would like to have those other three, at least two rat men over there. <laughs> I I could have apoed the uh, the lineman, but I wanted to save it just in case. <laughs> no, no, that's a sensible just in case. Trust me. Right, so... I think I would much rather have not used the apo at the end of the game than to have used the APO on 
the line rat and then a gutter runner die. Right. Because I've actually had that happen on this team. I apoed a storm vermin to save his life because I because uh, it's clay mouse fuse there because he got killed in the in an open ladder and uh, I was like, oh god, I gotta apo that. I can't go without him. He's got mighty blow. And then later in the game, my fourth gut gutter runner, um, a mousy Cooper, uh, got killed. Oh man, I don't have enough to stand up on the line anymore. Yeah, who's this? Who's that? There he is. They picked up the ball. I suppose I should say something memorable or funny here. Did you see the pass, Bob? You sometimes miss the subtle interaction. Yeah. I have a Storm Vermin with horns in the MML, and he's <laughs> one of my favorite players. Because horns is yeah, just, like you said, yeah. so good. Yeah. That's a solid formation. I want to see the opposing team have a go at the ball now. No, I should have thought about this better. Hmm. I mean, mathematically, this isn't impossible. Oh yeah, definitely not. I was thinking I had one turn and not two. They've gone into the opponent's tackle zone. Yeah, should be good. Fashion fight. Yeah, he's still alive. <laughs> but now it's mathematically impossible. <laughs> More the merrier. Even moves like a brown streak. Well, that's one way to describe it. I, I figured I had three rerolls left. Why not use it on the last yeah. option available? <laughs> yeah, <clears throat> not a bad move at all. Shoot, I would have. My team value would have been a lot lower had I known how many rerolls this team has. <laughs> I, I don't know why. I I was a noob. That's why it was like one of the first teams I made. <laughs> mm. 
I, I built the gutter runners decent, but then, like, the team overall, like you said, I or saw there, I have six re-rolls. And then, I think some of them I got from kickoff events, but I still have a lot. You don't, you don't, keep, yeah, you don't keep them from kickoff events, though. They disappear at the end of the game. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, well, I just meant, like, in this game in general, but... Oh, I gotcha. But I still do have a lot. The players yeah. arrive to assist their teammate. Yeah, well, let's... Better than hitting someone smaller than you, Jim. Oh. They're just getting pounded, pounded, and pounded. <laughs> That's why I, I think like this. every one of them has a, some kind of negative injury. <laughs> this is rough. That's the worst beating I've ever seen Linos take. Nice. He caught it without even right. moving. It just went right into his hand. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Chaos Warriors used to only have a two agility. And it's a, been a, an adjustment on my part to remember that they have a three now. So they can actually dodge, they can actually catch things. Yeah, they're you not useless. Yeah. Yeah. A fresh start, fellas. You can return to the snow. <clears throat> Alright, so. You've got seven players, and I've got to try to get down the field twice. See how the smaller squad will win. They've kicked the ball to the opponents. Now it's time to think defensively. Oh man, I took a beating. <laughs> I'm just sitting here looking at all of my injured players. <laughs> yep. I still think you're gonna win now. I might be able to tie it. Oh, perfect. See, there we go. Further proof that the game, my friend, is yours. <laughs> The riot helps me out a lot there. Yep. Sometimes cute animals like this forget the sport and embrace their island side.
<laughs> Double guard. He won't leave him alone in his <laughs> This formation gives him a safe progression. It's gonna be hard to make him lose the ball. Apparently, wizards call that kinetic energy. I don't think you're getting two dice four against him. Oh no no no. <laughs> <laughs> I was I, I wasn't looking for a two die. I was trying to see if there was any way to get at least a one die. Uh, same result. Essentially. I don't think you've missed a dodge roll yet. <laughs> I don't think I have. You guys are like bastards. Interesting. This player likes to be well assisted in a fight. These guys can't take it What? That wouldn't have happened in my cage. Ah. What happened there? I misclicked. Oh. Okay. I was making sure I wasn't seeing stuff, because that was... Nope. That's the only problem with this game. Never in tabletop would you accidentally choose the wrong guy. It yeah. shouldn't even be a possibility. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, it didn't select the die I tried to select. That sucks. 
I hate it when it does that. Yeah. Yeah. It, it, it shouldn't even be possible. It shouldn't even be a possible thing. Agreed. Damn it. There goes the tie. Both of those odds aren't terrible. Those are better. Those vermin are fast. That might have been a misplay. Nah, doesn't matter. <laughs> Come on, make this dodge. Oh, he doesn't. Hey, finally! You saved them all up for one roll. Alright. <laughs> oh, man. Time, I will select to knock you down if I get the option. Everybody wants a crowd push. Even yep. struggle to untangle that. Should hire a team player. Just another day in the life of a beast man. <laughs> Of Omicron Percy I eight. Yeah, I was so happy his whole name fit in the in the box. Yeah. <laughs> Surrounded by adversaries like that, I hope he knows what he's doing. I had a player that I wanted to give a really, really long name once and it just wouldn't fit. And I don't even remember what it was, but it was his title. Because that was gonna be his full, <laughs> like titled name. Right. Excellent use of his chaotic appendage. Ooh, that's an interesting choice. Oh, that's a very interesting choice. <laughs> well done, Philip J. Fry. <laughs> Good score, man. Good score. What oh. suspense? Uh, my poor team. <laughs> Five dead and injured. <laughs> I'm gonna have a. It may not be so bad. All of my line rats will be journeymen next game, so they're probably not as bad as my regular. Rats. Yeah. They're just. And they I guess just it kind of doesn't matter if they die. Yeah. I'm realizing one thing. I'm severely lacking is tackle. Yeah. 
But again, when you have a couple of Chaos Warriors die, you're rebuilding a bit. And the Headless Body of Agnew, if I get enough money, I'm just going to fire him and buy another one because he has no skills and a niggle. So, yeah. That's less than a out of the box player, value wise. Fry is coming along. I lucked out with that side stab on him. He's gonna be a real pain in the ass. He gets a couple more skills. Yeah. Side step is really nice. Yep. You gotta put guys on the line. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> I don't. I don't have the the correct amount of people to try the one turn touchdown. So, no. Come on, quick snap. It's hiking. No, but you definitely won the game. You think so? Oh yeah, I. For me to take the ball back, I've got four turns to score twice with. Yeah. Which is impossible, mathematically. Like there's not, there's not enough turns for me to do that. I guess. Yeah, that's true. I suppose. I like to believe that anything is possible in Blood Bowl, though, because I've seen some crazy yeah. stuff happen. I mean, I suppose the server can crash and we have to start over and then I can flip, potentially win, but... <laughs> I'll mark that in the highly unlikely category. Zach Brannigan! Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. Well, he's, uh... Zach Brannigan appears to be knocked out, almost. He apparently drank too much champagne. <laughs> Maybe his velour suit was a little too tight. <laughs> <laughs> yep. I don't think I have Kiff Coker on the team right now. I need to fix that. He'll probably just get killed. Okay. Sorry, I'm kind of analyzing the field. Eh, yeah, do you think? I bet the opposition didn't even see it go by. Against Skaven, I mostly relied on odor, Jim. When it smells like old cheese, I let it rip. I hear that uh, our announcers are saying the exact same thing. <laughs> I notice cool. sometimes they're not in sync. Yep.
Yeah, I need a lot more tackle. <laughs> it definitely helps. That play is looking wrong smug for remaining upright. Pride comes before the fall. <laughs> oh, him and his glowy horn. That's Leela, and yeah. I would prefer you to call her a her. <laughs> her, her glowing horn. Is the assist going to be enough to come out on top? That side step, though. They pass the ball, but will it be a complete? Oh man, you got a chance at an interception. Let's see if it's yeah, no, it never happens. Yep, there's your next and point. I was a uh, Muskaven team in the over. in the MML. It was over a long time ago. <laughs> uh, has been intercepted this three times, two, the, two yeah. games in a row. My last two games, and then the very first game of the season. Is it unsporting to not score? Oh man, you got that dude surrounded. Um, I'm gonna tr no, go ahead, don't score. Don't score. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I I missed that little uh, mugging circle you had on that gunner runner there. Yeah, yeah no, th this game was over last half, so I've been not really paying attention to how many more points you score. <laughs> I'm yeah. just going for SPPs on my guys, because there's no way I'm winning. Possible to win. Possession is the key to winning. Which must drive the coach crazy as his team has just kicked it away. Alright, good enough. Fair fight can be so overrated. There's always room in sport for a scrap like this. Uh, he needs dodge. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna have to use the A bow on him. Never mind. No, I don't have to. He's fine. I get to save it. Yeah. And it's not like you're gonna lose the game, so. You know, anybody who's out for the rest of the match is actually safe. <laughs> yeah, that's that's what I was thinking. We're definitely on the same page here. Yeah. 
Might have failed the action without his thing. His mutation, you mean, Bob? Yeah, that. <laughs> no. <clears throat> Come on, Zap. Oh. And they still. Oh well, that would have been nice. Yeah, the the SPP is always nice. No. I could probably score once more if I get a little bit of luck here. Where, where are you going? What? You're not gonna hang out? All right. I bet the opposition didn't even see it go by. Where, where are you going? I mostly rely on the thrower it's snuck a handle of vodka in his Let thrower mechanism there. <laughs> Uh, so they're all going down there, and they're gonna start uh, the pre the uh, post game celebration a little early. But we just want hugs. That's <laughs> all we want. Th those those other two guys had already uh, gotten into it a little bit. That lineman and that uh, Storm Vermin laying yeah. down there, they had already uh, been sneaking sips of it on the sideline before the kickoff. <laughs> gotcha. Let's see the armies. We go this way with it. Who do we thank? Thank you, Teach. Oh, bless you. you. Do have a tissue? There we go. I'm actually kind of hoping you do score again because if you do, I'm gonna try one turn touchdown. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there we go. He's in range. Yep. <laughs> All these gutter runners are like, ah, we could do something about it, but we're not gonna. <laughs> <laughs> we're just gonna let them uh, run down the field. Well, this is like when the fridge scored that touchdown. In the 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 cage <laughs> yep. It's a solid tactic. Justice. <laughs> well, we'll see. The domino effect in the air. Okay. I can't believe I botched that block against the thrower. <laughs> that was dumb. That cost me a tie. Injured. Man, I was gonna foul him! Why did he have to get injured? <laughs> why, why would you foul this close to the end of winning a game? <laughs> 
I gotta make never up. Never understood that mentality. I, I gotta make you up. You star player points for it. Oh, do you not? Okay, I thought you not, did. Not even one. Nope. Okay, so so the injury is fine then because I get SPP out of it. That's okay. Exactly. SPP is totally fine in that situation then. Fowling used to be so useful. Yeah. Now it's just kind of useful. Right. All it really does is break teams these days. Yeah. Not a wise place to end your turn on the border of the pitch. If the player gets pushed into a crowd, well, the last time that happened, well. it took three days to piece the body back together. You don't have a reroll, man. You just got you got to score for that level up there with the chaos warrior. <laughs> and the well, I'm not gonna win the game. <laughs> <laughs> this hey, man. It's not like this is hinging on the victory. It's all about the SPP, though. That's it. I believe in equal opportunity SPP. <laughs> Especially when it involves the robot devil. Bob, yeah. True. Supposed to remain neutral, you know? Well, it sure looks like it was a closer game than it was. Hey, it, it was. It was a very close game with all the injuries. Yeah. As as far as points, though, it never was. Had, had I not botched that roll, maybe it would have been a tie. But you, you pulled ahead really fast. Players. When you went up 2-0, that was the end. There was no coming back from that. I'm really good with these little bastards. Yeah, that's, uh, they're my preferred race. No. I don't think this is going to work, but I'm going to try it. I can always just pray for a sidestep. <laughs> mm -hmm. Because I don't think I have enough people to try this. Because I need a Lino here. Yeah, I can't I can't perform the act. <laughs> Let's see. If I had one more blitzer, maybe I could have. Alright, All right, I need a sidestep for the one turn. Nope. You need a sidestep? What do you mean? Not a sidestep, but a, um, a quick snap. Where you get the uh, oh. one extra square. Yeah. Yeah. Well, at least we get a vanity pass in. Yeah, that's true. Who do I want to take it? I might as well give him a level if I can. They grab yeah. the ball. A wise move, as it's quite fundamental to the game. Here comes the last chance. <laughs> he failed the easy part. And then he failed the not so easy part. Eh. Wow. Just right. wow. Well, good game. Well played indeed. I'm uh, definitely glad I woke up early to play this one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I didn't lose a fan factor. That's good. And the headless body of Agnew got the MVP. So. Heck yeah, my uh, again could be worse. I had one of my storm vermin. He leveled up. Now they're both uh, level yep. three. Jolly good show. Get this guy validated. Well. Yeah, he did. Okay, cool. And it's validated. Sweet. Cool.
All right, man. Well, good luck out there, and uh, I will probably run into you on the pitch again, I'm sure. I'm sure, man. I enjoyed it. Um, definitely yeah. glad I decided to play in this league. Yeah, we're we're a rowdy bunch, but we're yeah. you know our, our our league motto is "Don't be a dick." Yeah. Um, and I think that's pretty much all you need to have. Yeah, if you're just awesome. Kind of you know basing on that, everyone's cool. Um, and uh, yeah, it's been good. It's been good since I, mean, I kind of started it almost the day Blood Bowl came out. So it's yeah. been nice having to build and um, having 24 teams means we get um, we got the four squads of six teams mm -hmm. and then the top two from each go to the cup and then I'm doing a uh, best of the worst cup for the next oh yeah for teams. like last place so, <laughs> well, yeah, well better better than last yeah, yeah. <laughs> the cream of the crap yeah. Oh, I, I always call that the last place tournament because if you lose that one, you know, you're just done. <laughs> Which, I like those, uh, I have saw some leagues that will have bowl games like the MML did and the they'll have like the toilet bowl, which is the two, last two teams play each other to see who is the actual last place. So I think that's pretty cool too. Right, well, I now have three Chaos Warriors with block. Oh, nice. So that's a that's, good thing. That's really nice. And then... What do I give Hermes? He's got... I should probably give him block. Yeah. Alright. Horns, extra arms, movement allowance, and block. That's not bad. Cool. Alright, man. We'll have a good one. I'm off. You too, man. My other stuff for the day. Sounds good. Have a good one. Have you looked at Facetome recently, Bob? Did you know you have a fan club? Have you looked at it, Jim? There's a petition to remove you from the air. Okay. Spike Magazine, the periodical both players and fans read. A bunch of useless, talentless hacks, if you ask me. <laughs> <laughs> 